Hello, welcome to this tour of the Royal College of Music. I'm Enya, I'm an undergraduate flautist, and my friends and I will be showing you round today. This new social space opened at the college in 2020. The RCM Cafe serves sandwiches, snacks, coffee and hot food. The 1851 courtyard is at the heart of the college and is surrounded by college facilities. Hi, I'm Tia, an undergraduate vocal studies student and here we are in the Amaryllis Fleming Concert Hall. The concert hall was first opened in 1901 and was refurbished in 2009. This wonderful space is where we hold our orchestral performances, which are often led by external visiting professional conductors. Behind me, you can see the college's new organ, which was opened in the spring of 2018. And the walls are decorated with portraits of previous students at the college, such as Herbert Howells and even Benjamin Britten. This is the library and it is an essential part of daily life here at the RCM. It is a resource open to all members of the college and has approximately 200,000 resources in its contents in the forms of books, scores, recordings and e-documents. Even though the library is largely focused on music, there is other dedicated sections to literature, art, film, theatre and much more. Here is the Donaldson Room named after Sir George Donaldson, who was a major benefactor of the college when we first relocated to the Blomfield building. The room was originally the Donaldson Museum and housed a collection of early instruments, which were his gift to the RCM. The Britain Theatre was first opened by Her Majesty the Queen in 1986. The auditorium seats around 400 people, the pit accommodates 80 players, and the stage is 30 foot deep. The variable acoustic and high quality lighting and technical facilities make the Britain Theatre the perfect space for the RCM to host their operas, vocal competitions, performances and much more. RCM Studios is a fully equipped and professional recording studio owned by the RCM. The Bell Shankman Studio is the principal recording room here at the Royal College of Music, which is fully equipped with variable acoustics and a Steinway Model D Grand Piano. The room is even available to be booked by students during term time for sound and video recordings. This is the performance studio. It's a more intimate venue used for solo and chamber performance. It's used by all the faculties, but especially by the historical performance faculty as it's climate controlled, which helps preserve historical instruments. The new Royal College of Music Museum was opened in October 2021 by His Royal Highness Prince Charles. It houses accessible permanent displays, temporary exhibitions and galleries, a hands-on discovery area, a curated selection of items from the museum's collection, Many of the keyboard instruments in our collection are in playable condition and are played by our students during concerts and events. This is the Performance Hall. It's one of two new spaces that recently opened here at the college in 2020. The auditorium seats 120 people and due to the variable acoustics in this room, we can hold a wide range of concerts here at the college, such as chamber and solo concerts, all the way down to rehearsals. Here I am in the studio production suite, which is one of our three dedicated composition spaces. Hi, I'm Alex and I'm an undergraduate violinist at the Royal College of Music. The East, Inner and West Parry rooms are all located on the top floor of the Blomfield building. Their acoustics are perfect for chamber performances, recitals and other small events, all of which have a great view across onto the Royal Albert Hall. The performance simulator allows students to practice their performing and auditioning skills in front of a virtual panel or audience. The Exchange is where you'll find many student services, including the RCM's flagship Creative Careers Centre. It provides advice, guidance, referrals and resources for all RCM students and recent graduates. For those of you who are interested in percussion, we have a percussion suite which is purpose-built and on the top floor of this building. 
It has a number of rooms dedicated to different percussion instruments, as well as a main room for ensemble practice. Barsiem is a great place to go to relax in between classes, and you can even play pool there. It's the home of the Students' Union, who host events throughout the year, often with music played by RCM musicians. This is the Recital Hall, another one of the college's main performance spaces. And this area is used for concerts, recitals, masterclasses and chamber concerts. The Ziff Suite houses a number of soundproofed Amadeus pods which are available and equipped for all RCM instrumentalists and singers. A short walk from the Blomfield building and just next to the Royal Albert Hall is RCM J Muse. Here I am in the upper studio, which was the Royal College of Music's original concert hall before it was taken over by the English National Ballet. This space now is often used for rehearsal and practice. Our purpose-built accommodation building, Prince Consort Village, was developed especially for music students. Located in a leafy part of West London, you will be only 40 minutes away from the RCM via an easy tube or bus journey. There are also 23 practice rooms open 24 hours a day and acoustically treated bedrooms for your practice in your own room. Thank you for joining us on this tour of the Royal College of Music. We really hope you've enjoyed it and that you visit us again soon.